How many of you guys track your spouses wherever they go? This is one of those videos that I do where a lot of people are scared to comment or like because a lot of you guys are guilty of this. But I know you're watching and I'm about to tell you this is not normal. It's okay to have a tracker on your kids' cars, on your kids' phones in case they're in trouble. Even your spouse, if they're going somewhere and you're worried about them getting lost or something happening, I get it. But you guys are checking your spouse's locations or your boyfriend, girlfriend's locations on a regular basis. This is so weird. I'm sorry. At some point, you guys have to trust one another. I'm not saying be an idiot and just say, hey, go do whatever you want whenever you want. But you got to have some trust. If you guys have that much time on your hands, you are not busy in life. You need to find something to get busy with. And I'm not even going to get started about how many people are putting, I don't even know what they're called. They're like little tiny chips that people put inside other people's cars or somehow get in their phones and they listen to their spouses or significant others' conversations. You guys are sick in the head. We are not supposed to know what our spouse is saying all the time. If we knew what everyone thought or said, we would not have one friend in life. This is not normal. It's not a way to live. A lot of you people live this way because you guys are guilty and you guys are sick and you guys badmouth everybody or you guys are big cheaters and you think everyone's like you. It's not a healthy way to live. If you're going to live this way, don't go in a relationship. Just bounce around. Why not?